Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming an unboxing video of the cloth and paper subscription box for March. So let's go ahead and get started. So upon opening your cloth and paper subscription box, you are going to have um, different little journaling cards. This one was just kind of like a positive thinking journaling card along with a thank you card along with a discount code. And it came with a little SWOT analysis um, journaling card for this box this month. So I thought both of those were particularly important, especially because of the whole corona pandemic that we are currently going through. Um, just making sure you have like a more positive mindset during everything, um, just because you can kind of get a little bit lost with your own thoughts. So the first thing that I um, pulled from this unboxing were the tabbed sticky notes. Um, we have been getting these so far in every box this year, just in different colors. Um, so I am going to be including at least one of these in a giveaway soon. I just wanna like make it like a milestone giveaway and not just a random one. Um, so once I hit those numbers, you will see a giveaway here on my page. Um, the next thing, in the subscription box were two of these packs of journaling cards. And so these are really cool because they're kind of on a thicker card stock, but they have that dot grid. They have a little stripe of like a neutral color at the top and we got two packs of them, one in the pink and one in the gray color. Um, so I could see myself using those a lot. The next thing that we got in our box was a habit tracker. Um, these are sticky, sticky note habit trackers. Um, so I think I definitely will be using these. I intended on using a page in my um, planner for these, but I might actually switch to just using the post-it so I have a little bit more room in my planner and just might remove those pages. Um, then after that, the next thing in our box was this little, um, I'm not too sure what size it is. It's a little bit bigger than pocket, um, but not as big as personal. Um, I'm sure somebody knows what size it is, but it's like a field note size book and it is um, supposed to be a mood tracker. So every day you are supposed to track what your mood was, um, kind of your, and then I'm pretty sure it's like positive affirmations and like things like that. Um, just to kind of work on where your mood started, how your affirmations kind of um, develop, and you know, focusing on how your mood overall affects your health, um, both mentally and physically. So I really liked this book. Um, it was the same layout except for the last two pages, which just have two pages of notes. Um, but I really like this. It's a little bit different for cloth and paper, I think. It's kind of like self-help. Um, but I really like that they included something a little bit different. The next thing that came in our box here was, I believe this is the meal planner. I can't really see yet. So yeah, this is the meal planner. So it has breakfast, lunch, and dinner and then like and then a snack and then every day of the week so it's like a calendar layout so you can kind of plan your meals out for a month um and i just really like it it's just a pretty simple layout that you know you can personalize to be whatever works for you so i actually might use that in the place of those habit tracker pages that i put in in my last rings planner set up. So I'll probably have to do another rings planner set up here for you guys soon. And then I'm just trying to finagle that bad boy back into its little silo bag here. I am not, look, I like messed up the corners and then I got really frustrated. So I just decided not to put it in the bag. Um, the next thing that came in our box was a dashboard. I like this one too. It's it's a little bit um, more abstract. I feel like cloth and paper sometimes is very structured. Um, so the abstract part of it is really cool. And then we got another dashboard, everything negative, pressure and challenges is all an opportunity for me to rise. There is a comfort is overrated. 
exceptionality is no accident and find your focus as like the three focus areas for this month on that dashboard. So I thought that was kind of a cool dashboard. And then this one just says perseverance is not a long race. It is many short races, one right after the other. Um, Again, just really inspirational dashboards. I really like to get dashboards in these boxes every month. And this little kind of Dutch door looking half page insert here is really cool. Um, I haven't gotten a chance to use it yet because I just set up my planner. So I'm kind of trying to get used to the new layout that I just put in there. Um, but these ones, and I'll bring it up close here are like calorie intake and like weight watching, um, like an exercise fitness insert. So I really like those. And then we got some more of that um, dot grid kind of paper as a Dutch door style thing. The only thing that I wasn't a big fan of is that the grays are slightly different from each other. Um, I do wish that they were the same, but besides that, I really liked everything that came in the subscription box this month. Like I've said before, I feel like I'm definitely getting my money's worth. Oh, there was one more insert. This is the recipes one. So the other one is kind of like a like meal prep breakdown. And then this is like recipes for each of those things um, that you meal prepped for in the like calendar view one that they provided for us. So overall, like I said, everything in this box I feel was extremely valuable. I will use them. Um, I didn't feel like anything this month was like a waste or um, just filler. I really think that everything is super functional and I will continue to use my subscription box. Feel free to like this video if you liked this video and subscribe if you want to subscribe. Also check out my Instagram page for the giveaway that I was talking about and other updates from me. Um, I've been doing more artsy spreads since there's been a little bit less planning going on lately with this whole COVID-19 thing. So with that being said, um, everyone stay safe. Bye.